It's often the case when um, we're on this morning, we're on this end of the week, but Carol, you're hiding amongst something beautiful. Absolutely right, Naga and Charlie. Good morning, everyone. I'm at Camus Farm at the moment, Camus Hull Farm, and you can see lots and lots of sunflowers all around me. In fact, if we take an aerial shot, you can see just how many there are. There are approximately 100,000 sunflowers in bloom right now and wow they look spectacular and some of the flowers from other farms actually they've been saying that they have been flowering quite late I'm just struggling through them at the moment um, because of the lack of warm weather and in fact it is going to be quite warm today for many of us although first thing this morning you might find it's a bit chilly if you're standing outside for any length of time now the forecast for today is one of some heavy showers some of which will be thundery and wherever you are it's going to be breezy or indeed it is going to be windy low pressure once again is actually dominating our weather it's anchored to the northwest it's got fronts around it and there's a front sinking south which is producing a bit more cloud and some drizzle at the moment so today once again you can expect some heavy thundery showers especially across western Scotland but some of those will be getting in across Northern Ireland and into Northern England as well. South of that some sunshine but still a fair bit of cloud around at times but when the cloud thins and breaks and the sun comes out well the temperatures will get up to about 23 degrees but as we push further north especially if you're in the showers temperatures will be that bit lower in fact in the far north of Scotland we're looking at temperatures only of 12 degrees Degrees today so that's way below average and it will feel quite cool now heading on through the evening and overnight we will hang on to a lot of those showers across the north of the country there'll be some clear skies some dry weather but by the end of the night another weather front coming in from the southwest will introduce thicker cloud across southwest England in through parts of South Wales and into the Midlands and around the coast and hills once again you could see some drizzle from that but as a result it's not going to be a cold night so tomorrow we start off with the rain across the central swathe of England and Wales. Now to the north of that, in Scotland and parts of Northern Ireland, it will be dry, there'll be a few showers around, and to the south of it, we're also looking at some sunny skies, but again, areas of cloud, and the cloud here and there are thick enough for some spots of drizzle. Then for Sunday, well on Sunday we've got two weather fronts affecting us. One across the north of Scotland, that's going to sink southwards through the day, taking its rain with it across the far north. And we also still do have some rain coming in across Wales and into the north of England. But in between, there should be some sunshine. The cloud in the south, if that breaks for long enough, well we could have highs here of 24, but in the north it's still a little bit cooler. I'll have lots more in the sunflowers and the weather in half an hour.